From Storm Tracker 6, this is Weather First, sponsored by Auto Owners Insurance. Simple human sense. Well, out on our quad cam, you can see those temperature sensors, and they're indicating that those temps are just a little bit above zero. Now, here in Lansing and in Grand Ledge, we're seeing some clouds and off and on lake effect flurries. But when you head over towards Hillsdale, it's actually mostly sunny. That's because these lake effect clouds are just going a little bit too far north. Now, when you head farther out of mid Michigan and more towards the east side of the state, you'll also be seeing more sunshine, but even that won't help protect you from these cold temperatures. Looking at satellite and radar, you can tell where the cold air is because it's snowing down towards Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia. Those are places that don't typically get snow and it has to be very cold for that to happen. Right now, those current wind chills around 15 degrees in Lansing down to one or 15 below in Lansing, one below in Dallas. Now, it's going to be an incredibly cold stretch here in mid-Michigan. For the next few days, we're dealing with these below zero temperatures. Feels like 15 below in Lansing had been down close to 30 below this morning in cold water. So it is an improvement, even though it doesn't necessarily look like it. Now, when you look at our weather alerts across the nation, there's a lot of periwinkle and blue, and both of those indicate wind chill advisories and wind chill warnings. We do still have some wind chill advisories still in our area. Those actually were just issued in the they go until we get to tomorrow at 11 a.m. So, or weather Wednesday at 11 a.m. So, they're really expecting these cold temperatures to stick around. Looking at what we have for tonight, two degrees at overnight low. We're going to be seeing some isolated snow showers out there. Otherwise, those cloudy skies continue, and we still still have that chance for some little bit pockets of snow popping up as we go into tomorrow. As with high temperatures around nine degrees, so we're still very cold and with the wind chill it makes it even worse. Here's what our feels like temperature is looking like as we go through the rest of the day today. Still could have some spots that drop down to around 20 below zero as we go overnight. Those wind chills still are bitterly cold when you head south of 94, but a little bit farther to the north, we're sheltered by Lake Michigan. The cold air not quite able to get up into that area, so you should be closer to that 10 below mark by tomorrow morning. Then as we go forward into Wednesday, still seeing some dangerously cold wind chills. Finally, though by Thursday it starts to get to above zero so it will get better it's just going to take some time our overall trend shows that we do have warmer air building to the west for the end of the month and that should gradually work its way towards us on the six day forecast it might not look like too much of an improvement when we get towards Thursday highs are only around 20 degrees but it's really the overnight lows that will be giving us a break 10 back to the double digits above zero other than that though it looks like those overnights are going to be very cold and that's what's giving us that chance for some additional snow showers. Now we will be seeing a dry day pop up there for Wednesday, staying mostly dry today if you don't count those lake effect flurries. And then of course Saturday too, also popping up as mostly cloudy. The thing you don't see a lot of on here is sunshine. That's because it just isn't going to be popping in. With this cold air streaming across the relatively mild lake waters, it's just putting a lot of moisture in the atmosphere that condenses into clouds. Not quite enough for us to get much lake effect snow in mid-Michigan, but mm -hmm. still enough to make it look like winter gloom. Yeah. But I tell you what, it's cold outside, isn't it? It is. Woo. Oh Woo. my gosh, I mentioned yeah. earlier, my windshield yeah. cracked. Yeah. Straight across. I got a good look yeah. at it now that the sun is up. and That's not going to be fun. Now, don't go outside if you don't have to, but yeah. if you want to step outside just to fill it just for a moment, it's pretty powerful. Yes. <laughs> it it yeah. hurts. It does. Inside. It's, it's, you could tell it's uh, below zero. Yeah. All right. Well, an 